Hi, I'm Caden, and I'll be rapping So Far So Good, all about African wildlife, by Bonnie Worth, illustrated by Aristide Ruiz and Joe Matthew. And this is part one. I'm the cat in the hat, pack your bag, come with me. We're going to Africa on safari. Pack your sunglasses and your sun hat. Remember your camera, do not forget that. You got from a seat to my animal viewer. The truck we will take on our African tour. In the African game park, you will be getting the chance to see wildlife in a natural setting. But here is a fact I will tell you today. Animals are predators or else they are prey. Predators hunt weaker animals to munch. Prey tries hard not to be a predator's lunch. Off to the river, we will go first. Here animals come to quench their thirst. Look at those war talks tripping out over there. Mom damn piglets with tails in the air. African buffalo graze where it's wet. Their horns have the look of a sturdy helmet. Grass 90 pounds, a hippo eats nightly. Are the baby called calves? Yes, you guess rightly. Really. A hippo skin can burn the sun rays. Mud and water protect her so that's where she stays. Let's move on to the lions with their tiny hides. They live all together in groups known as prize. A cub has brown spots from his tail to his ear. At three months of age, all the spots disappear. Mothers like sleeping for most of the day. The roars rattle windows from miles away. I'll name you a cat that one rarely sees. The cat is the leopard who hangs out in trees. A leopard's black spots come in very neat sets of circular patterns that are called rosettes. She stalks, runs, and leaves to hunt down a prey. She hunts in the night and she sleeps in the day. The cheetah is covered with sleek spotted fur. The cheetah can't roar, but oh, she can purr. With long and strong legs, the cheetah has power to run up to 70 miles an hour. Cheetahs run past, and here's the scoop. Cubs sometimes play soccer with elephant poop. Speaking of elephants, here is the word. 50 or so can be in one herd. Male elephants can grow to 11 feet high and weigh over 10 tons. Hello there, big guy. Cows walk from day one and have some body hair, which soon all rubs off due to life's wear and tear. The whole herd will circle and sound the alarm and crowd around the young ones to keep them from harm. The elephants' tusks are tools, as you see, for scraping off roots or the bark of a tree. They also will use their tusks in a fight, and they tend to favor the left or the right. And just as one hand of yours is the stronger, one of an elephant's tusks can be longer. The trunk gives the elephant's very long nose, which can lift heavy things or spray like a hose. Or pick up one single blade of green grass, or blow out like a tuba that is made out of grass. Two kinds of rhinos, oh, you are so right. One is called black, the other is called white. But both rhinos are gray and dicks can recite. So how do we tell the black from the white? A white rhino's lips are wild like a bow. He nibbles at grass, his head hanging low. A black rhino's lips are agile with these. He reaches out to crop low leaves from the trees. Is that ox pecker bird hitching a ride? And is she's eating the tits on the white rhino's hide. Be sure to like and subscribe to Escape in Time. Bye.